Hello everyone. Now today we will see a story, a story of a greedy dog. Okay, an English story. The name of the story is the greedy dog. The greedy dog. Now see here the story name is the greedy dog. The story name is the greedy dog. Okay, now see here. Before starting the story, before narrating the story, let's see what is this. Who is this children? Who is this? This is a dog. Dog. So what will he he have? What is this? This is a. This is a bone, right? This is a bone. Next, see here. This is also a dog. Then comes here. This is a dog, also a dog, right? He is carrying meat. So see here first. Then this is a river which he need to cross. He need to cross. Okay. Then comes this is a also a dog and the and below is the moral of the story. Okay. Now shall we start, children? See, story name is the greedy dog. The greedy dog. Now see here. One day, what happened? One day, that is one day, a dog found a piece of meat. So what? What is the dog found? He found a piece of meat. One day, a dog. Listen carefully. One day a dog found found a piece of meat. He was also feeling hungry. So he found a piece of meat. So one day this dog that is one day a dog found a piece of meat. So what happened? If he found the piece of meat, you can come from here. Then the second is, he thought, what he thought? He wanted to eat the meat at kennel. That means, he wanted to eat the meat at home. This is his home. Kennel means home. It's home. So, what he thought? He was hungry. He found one day a piece of meat here. He found one day a piece of meat here. So, what he thought in his mind? He thought, you can come here, see my action. Okay. So, he thought in his mind, he will take the meat and, and he will have it at his home. That is, he will have the meat at the kennel. Okay. So, he was thinking, he was imagining. He was imagining that is, he means who? The dog. So, he wanted to eat the meat at home. We will revise once again. See. One day a dog, one day a dog found a piece of meat. So what he did? He was imagining he found a piece of meat. So he wanted to eat the meat at his home. So he wanted to, he wanted to eat the meat at home. Then what happened? After this, he came to, after this, he came to see the arrow is going here, here and then the arrow is going. So, the dog, what happened he did? What he did was, he, he, he had to, for that he had to, he, he wanted to go to its home, right? He wanted to eat the meat at his home and home is far away. He wanted to cross the bridge, then only he can cross a river, then only he can Reach his home. Okay. So see for that. What he did. He had to cross a river. To reach home. To reach his home. He need to cross a river. This is a river. This is a small narrow bridge. Which he need to cross. To, to go or to reach his home. So what he did. He had to cross a river. To reach home. So what happened. Let's see. What happened. Then the dog. Was having this bone here. That is the meat here. Okay. So what I mean? He need to cross 
the river see as he was crossing he looked down into the water see he was cross he was crossing here see at the middle of the bridge you can see here he was crossing right he was crossing suddenly he saw near his he saw down into the water that that means he looked down into the water so if you see in the mirror so what you will see you will see an another of you no right no right what you will see you will see your reflection you will see your reflection right so the same the dog also looked down into the water on the middle of the bridge while crossing he looked down into the water he was having the meat not any one as he saw he saw his reflection only but he thought in his mind what he thought he thought in his mind there was another dog who was carrying the meat so what he did he was greedy okay he barked at the dog ba 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 he barked at the dog how can i ca how can he he carry that is how can the another dog carry meat it is he only the one who should carry the meat and he is going to home for that only he is crossing a river and then he need to go to home while crossing the river he saw his reflection but he he never thought it was his reflection instead what he thought he thought there was another dog who is carrying the meat so he barked at the dog and said bha 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 he barked at the dog so what happened see the line comes here then what happened as he opened his mouth for barking his meat fell into the river now actually his meat fell into the river he was expecting more than one he ha he had one meat right he was expecting more than one he was expecting two now what happened he is left with none right so as he opened his mouth for barking his meat which was in the in his mouth he was holding his mouth fell into the river so finally what the dog got the dog lost the meat he was left with none right the dog lost the meat for that he was crying see the dog lost the meat see right so here what is the moral the moral is see the moral of the story is be happy with what you have what you are having you should be happy with it you should not expect more if you expect more either you will end up with nothing or you will end up with what you are having okay so it's better moral of the story in each story there will be a lesson there will be a lesson for us the moral from this is that is the moral from the greedy dog is be happy with what you have why greedy dog this is a dog but he was greedy that's why the name was greedy dog the greedy dog now i am revising once again just to see the name of the story is an english story the name of the story is the greedy dog it's about a dog who is greedy who was having a meat okay he was greedy he wanted one more meat he end up with nothing now see how you can see here i am i am narrating once again he is a dog right children he is a dog so one day what happened a dog he found a piece of meat here so after he found a piece of meat he he what he did he he was thinking he will eat the meat at his home that is at his kennel he will eat the meat so he wanted to eat the meat at home then next comes here is the can see here comes he had to cross a river for that what he did for to reach home to reach the dog's home he need to cross a river what he need to do is he need to cross a river to reach home cross a river that means this river he need to cross this is a narrow bridge he need to cross a river to reach home so what happened he is trying to go now you see he is going here going here going here then he is coming here for crossing 
as he was crossing that is at the middle of it as he was crossing he what he did is he looked down into the water he looked where he looked he looked down into the water if we look in the mirror what we see we see our reflection right we see any other person no right we see our reflection only we will see there okay now see so the dog also looked into the water the water is transparent so so in the water itself that is in the river itself if the dog is seeing the dog will see his reflection and not the other person or other the dog will be there right so this is the simple thought which he didn't thought of what he thought there was some another dog dog who is also carrying meat so he thought this meat also he should have that's why he started to barking is he started to bark at the dog at this dog he started to bark ba 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 that means what happened see here the story came here ended up here as he opened his mouth his meat fell into the river so finally what the dog got he got nothing he left with nothing he was having one meat he wanted one more meat that is more than one what he left with he was left with nothing not not even the one meat which he was having so the, the finally the dog lost the meat so see here that's why the dog is feeling guilty this was his reflection and not another dog who is carrying the meat okay so what is the lesson of the story what is the moral of the story is we should be happy with what we have that is be happy with what you have i hope everyone ha has liked the video like the story the the greedy dog okay like the story the greedy dog thank you children thank you everyone for listening for listening the story the way i am narrating thank thanks a lot it really means me a lot thank you once again